What's up, everybody? It's your host, Claire Dragoon, and uh, I'm, I'm, I've been practicing a little bit, so I'm going to call this a practice series. Uh, I've just been trying some new attacks for me at Town Hall 9. You, you guys know I do a lot of attacks on my Town Hall 8 minis, but right here recently, um, I just need to get ready, war ready for my Town Hall 9, uh, and so that's what I've been doing. And we'll go to my attack log, and I'll show you a couple of these attacks and I don't even know what these attacks are called maybe you guys know I don't I don't know man but here, here we go we'll take a look at this one against this guy named Zane and you know when I looked at his base I thought it looked kinda snazzy uh, so I was like huh he had decent loot you know and I was like hmm now his bows are only level one but they were they were down so I mean I did kinda you know if you were in war you know, you would attack, you would look at a base, you know, his bows were down, bows up. You know, you look for all that stuff to determine what type of attack you would do. And plus this guy had air defense that was really uh, close to the outsides, easy to pick off. And I'd never tried this attack strategy. So, of course, when I seen the bows were down on this base, I was like, yep, I'm going in. Queen was easy to get to. As you can see, she's right there. No problem. So, I had to try it. If you guys know what this attack is, please tell me. I I know it's um, it's uh, it's basically a Gola Loom, but it's with the lightning and uh, and earthquake. And I had a teammate suggest this, um, and so I decided to try it. So here we go. Without any further ado, uh, and it, it this attack has got to be noob friendly because it was like uh, maybe the second time I had tried it. So. <laughs> Uh, that lets you know, it, you know, for me, uh, I was very unfamiliar with it. But here I am, I'm lightning striking and EQing these uh, these air defense in the core. They're, they're going to go down. Uh, my queen took out the other one. You know, my king's, he's, he's going off on a little tangent. But here comes my hounds coming in. And, I, and, and guys, uh, remember now, I only had, uh, you know, 28 seconds or so to uh, plan this attack. So... If, if my deployment methods are kind of goofy, you know, just understand. I mean, I'm, I was learning. So I got way too many hounds, uh, obviously. And you'll see in the end um, that there was just way too many hounds. I didn't need that many hounds. But anyway, uh, and obviously I, I probably deployed way too many loons the way I did it. But it, it just works out so perfectly at this point but it's a very slow attack guys and both times uh that i did these raids uh last night i ran down the clock i mean i got in the red so there's maybe a couple of things that that i would change on my deployment and not take as much time on the the opener um or the first phase of the attack i'd probably speed it up a little bit but as you can see the base is broken it's basically um, it's basically just a matter of time now. So I'm going to speed it up. And we'll just watch the little loons do their work. They're going to kill the king. <laughs> Eventually. He tried to live, but you know. I think I popped one hound. Uh, maybe. <clears throat> maybe. And as you can see, I, I don't har I hardly have any uh, lava pups to, uh, to help me out here. But if you guys know the name of this attack, please tell me. I... I don't watch YouTube that much. I only watch a couple of tubers, and uh, this one, this one is, I've seen it. I think, I think maybe Ashlyn uh, had it or Gotti, um, but I, I can't remember. But anyway, let's look at the second one. I did, and see the first one, I did. Um, I think, I think I didn't have any. I didn't. I didn't have any golems. So it was basically just uh, a go la loon. Um, my heroes uh, done, you know, they'd done the work on on one thing. But on the second one here, I tried a cold-blooded go la loon. But with the spell comp, I guess you would call it something else. And, and you guys, like I said, you guys tell me what the difference is. But, um, but this base, as I was going through uh, my search queue... Um, he had really nice loot, and I hate this base. This, this, I, I guess they call it the Galatrap. 
Oh, by the way, if, if, if that other base I attacked has a name, um, if it's an internet base, please leave it in my comment section. Uh, I, I, that's the first time I've seen it, but, but you, you guys know this base. It's, it's, it's a gala trap, as far as I know. That's what they call it. It's so common, I push the champs on this base. Um, it's, it's easily uh, defeatable uh, to go to champs with, with just Lunian. So, uh, I just, when I see this kind of base, it's like, okay, you know, you can hog this base. I don't even know why people use this base. You can hog this base. You could do what I'm fixing to do to it. Uh, go la loon this base. It's just not a good base. But back in the day against normal farming armies, you know, post update, who knows what a farming army is now. But, uh, before the update, People, you know, if they tried to barch against you or something like that, I mean, this base would hold out. It spreads your loot out, I guess. Maybe that was a good thing, but, you know, I'm just, it's just overused. So I, I just, I loved it. I was like, great, I'm going to attack this base. So here we go. I'm going to take out a couple of the air defense. And there again, remember, this is a 28 second uh, planning. <laughs> so I'm winging it and, uh, just going for it. So here we go. I'm coming in on the queen side, obviously, uh, with my golems and my, my wizards. I'm getting a good spread on them so that my uh, my heroes will go up in there. And I'm hoping... All I'm trying to do out of my queen here is get that air defense. That's all I want. And as you can see, it's going to take a little bit of time. And it causes me at the end of this raid to be down to the wire. My king's going off, you know, it, it, it split it split my uh, heroes into these two compartments. And the king's trying to get to the queen now, but she's just going to, she's just going to bust him up. He's busted up right now. So now my, my queen revenges him. Now she locks into the air defense and I'm like, yes, I can let loose my hounds. So I made three hounds on this. Uh, so I, I tried to back off from the first raid. It seemed like my hounds didn't pop. I, I wanted to get more usage out of my hounds on this one. So here we go. I'm coming around the base. And a hound has not popped yet. Now the loons I dropped at the bottom down there, I think I might have messed up on them because they didn't have any tanking. But... That was the last uh, the last quadrant there, so I just dropped them. It was a mistake. As you can see, they went down. Um, but these balloons here in the core still have tanking from the hounds. I got two hounds left, and uh, I'm hoping they'll pop at some point, but my balloons took that air mine pretty rough. But they're coming in. My hounds are still tanking. And they are not going to pop. They are not going to pop. So at this point, I, I remember thinking, am I going to three-star this base? Really? So I didn't know. I got kind of concerned. But as you can see, it gets in the red. I get a little, you know, a little apprehensive, wondering if I'm going to get it. But, hey, it works out. I go down to the wire and I get it. So... I'm just for me guys if I can do this attack you can do this attack this attack is is pretty easy if I can three star like this and it's the first few times I ever tried it uh, definitely give it a try it's awesome awesome attack uh, thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed it and like I said if you know those base designs well not the gala trap but the other one please leave it in the comment section and if you know the actual name of this attack Leave in the comment section. I, I would appreciate it. I, I, I don't even know. Like I said, I, uh, one of my teammates just suggested I use a spell comp and this army comp. And I tried it and it works great. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed.